In this video, you will learn basic division. Number one, three divided by 12. Three divided by 12 is not the same as 12 divided by three. Hindi yan pwede. Ang three dito ay yan yung tinatawag nating dividend. While itong 12, yan yung divisor. And that is equals to quotient. Equals to quotient. Dividend, the number that is being separated into smaller groups. Divisor, the number of groups that the dividend is being separated into. While quotient, the answer to a division problem. It is the number of items in each group. So, itong 3 divided by 12, ito yung 3 divided by 12. Ang 3, again, yan yung dividend. Ang 12, yan yung divisor. Ang sagot dito, yan yung quotient. Now, let's proceed. 3 divided by 12. Ilang 12 ba sa 3? Wala. So, magdagdag tayo ng isa pang 0. Pero bago ka magdagdag, maglagay ka muna ng decimal dito. At yung decimal na yan, i-align mo sa taas. Then, dagdagan natin ng isa pang 0. 30 divided by 12, or ilang 12 ba itong 30? Dalawa. 2 times 12, that is equals to 24. 30 minus 24, and that is equals to 6. Magdagdag ka pa ulit na isa pang 0. I-bring down mo yan siya. Now, 60 divided by 12, or ilang 12 ba sa 60? 5. 5 times 12, and that is equals to 60. 60 minus 60 is equals to 0. Now, ito na yung sagot. Point 0.25. Letter B, point 0.25. Para mas klaro sa inyo na itong quotient is the number of items in each group, mag-drawing tayo. Tatlong box or tatlong square, i-divide natin ng 12. 3 divided by 12. So, tatlo yan, i-divide natin ng 12. I-divide muna natin. I-divide natin siya, of course, equally. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Kulang pa. So, i-divide ulit natin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12. Each group, this is equals to 1 fourth. 1 fourth is also the same as 0 0.25. Number 2. 10 divided by 5 times 4. Again, we have to follow order of operations or kilalang PEMDAS. Unahin ang nasa loob ng parenthesis and that is equals to 20. So, this is 10 divided by 20. Again, itong 10, this is dividend. Ang 20, ito yung divisor. At ang sagot dito, yan yung quotient. Now, 10 divided by 20. Ito yung dividend. At ito naman yung divisor. Now, 10 divided by 20. Although obvious naman siya na half siya, yung 10 ay half sa 20. At ang sagot dyan ay 0.5. Pero isa-isahin lang natin. Kailangan tayo magdagdag na isang zero kasi wala mang 20 sa 10. Pero bago natin gawin yan ay maglagay muna tayo ng decimal dyan. At yung decimal na yan ay i-align mo sa taas bago ka magdagdag na isa pang zero. Now, 100 
divided by 20 and that is equals to 5. 5 times 20 is equals to 100. 100 minus 100 equals 0. So ito na yung answer. Point 5. Letter B. To understand more about division, laging tandaan. Dividend divided by divisor is equals to quotient division ulit ito yung dividend nandito naman yung divisor at ito yung quotient Pagdating naman sa fraction, this fraction line means division. So, ito yung dividend natin, yung numerator. Yung denominator, yan yung divisor. And that is equals to quotient. 